Jess, and welcome to the Sabre Roar. I'm Partivi. And I'm Brianna. Today we will be bringing you the latest news around the school and music performances. New to FHS this year, freshman students are being guided towards the career they want to pursue through a program called Inroads. Freshman students were given the opportunity to pick from three different career clusters, those being biomedical, engineering, and global business. Inroads is a program for students um, which allows them to um, personalize their learning experience in the area of, a, of a sh what we call a strand, which many ways, in many ways relates to a career or a program of study. As Inroads continues forward, more strands will be offered for the students. We're only a short ways into the school year, but um, uh, teachers are um, uh, seeing students that are engaged, seeing students that um, have clear direction in what they're learning. Mr. Nowak, Mr. Cohn, and Ms. Rock all have been working hard to develop the program and open up opportunities for the student success. Next year, a digital communications and media arts strand will be added. Students who are interested in pursuing a career in film, video, graphic arts, advertising, marketing, and more will have a jump start in high school. With fall just around the corner, it's time for many students to start looking for colleges. This year, Franklin held its annual Wisconsin Education Fair in the cafeteria. There were about 100 colleges at the WEF, which gave students a large selection. Kind of a one-stop shop for being able to get information about college. There are colleges, technical schools, trade schools, military, even financial aid session available where students can get all the information within a two-hour time period. At the booths, you could ask about anything from campus lifestyle to extracurricular activities. Students could also pre-register online, so when they got to the fair, all they needed to do was scan their barcode. Their information is automatically downloaded to the college, and then the college can have them on their mailing list and send them more information. If you missed the education fair at Franklin, check the Guidance Counselor's page on the FHS website for more information and other college fairs coming soon. This year, teachers and administrators have began to roll out a new school program called Saber Pride. Saber Pride is a program created to promote and highlight positive behavior from students and staff. It started last year with the Student Uproar Award, where teachers nominate a deserving student who exemplifies the values of respect, responsibility, and readiness. These students have been highlighted in episodes of the Saber Roar and on the Saber Slate. About time. My gosh, I've been nominating her every week. What a Additionally, this year, the Saber Roar will highlight the winning class of Chip Off the Old Block, which rewards outstanding classes with Chips Ahoy cookies from Mr. Decker, and with the Teacher of the Week, where students get the chance to reward worthy teachers with the giant traveling trophy. Another new addition to the Saber Pride this year is the Freshman Mentoring Program, where upperclassmen help freshmen with their transition into high school. I think it's really helpful. I think it helps keep them in check with their grades and how their schoolwork is going. The goal for the Saber Pride is to have the entire program put into effect next year to continue promoting a positive school climate. Watch for more recognitions of students and staff in future episodes and in the new common areas once the construction is finished. This school year had had many firsts for the choir as they performed their first ever concert in the new auditorium along with their new fall concert theme. Ms. Schlecht and the choir students agreed that practicing their holiday concert music in September felt odd. They wanted to try something new with the new auditorium by adding a fall concert instead of waiting till December to have their first concert. Uh, last year at the end of the year we did a Broadway themed concert for our spring concert and I found that the students really had an interest in that type of music. After seven weeks of preparation, the fall Broadway concert performance in the new auditorium was a success featuring music selections from Sweeney Todd, Mamma Mia, and Chicago. After the choir had a chance to reflect on their Broadway performance, they have started rehearsing their music for their holiday concert. Typically it's um, traditional Christmas carols, um, just some holiday music. We have some music from Frozen, which is pretty exciting, and just a, just a variety of different types of winter-themed music. We're looking forward to the choir's upcoming concert in December. Hope to see you there. The Franklin High School Marching Band students recently went to UW-Whitewater to compete in the WSMA State Marching Band Championship. This year at the state competition, the marching band played Piano Man, the music of Billy Joel. Students have been practicing music for this competition since last May. They have worked on it by themselves, in groups, and as an entire ensemble. 
it was a full day of competition um, featuring 40 bands from across the state of Wisconsin, um, and we competed against nine other bands in our class. So I'm really excited about the path that this band is taking. It's really student-led, and um, seeing their passion um, is really, really rewarding, and I'm so proud of all that they have accomplished this year and over the past several years. We congratulate the marching band on all their achievements this year. Now let's spare a few moments to recognize two stellar students. Um, I nominated a very special senior. He's the best PE aide I have had in 14 years. And I nominated him because of his dependability, his maturity, his leadership, and his kindness. Hi, I'm Mrs. Retzoff and I nominated Devin Knightman because um, he is a wonderful student without prompting or asking for help. Whenever someone needs a little extra, he just pitches in, he gets out of his seat, he jumps up, he helps someone who's in need. He's um, just a really respectful young man and um, so willing to help others. A huge congratulations to Muhammad and Devin. Enjoy your prizes. Thanks for watching the Sabre Roar. Signing off, I'm Pro TV. And I'm Brianna. Have a great Tuesday, Franklin. See you next week.